Jack, you good? You, you know you don't have to be honest. Sooner or later, they'll know who you really are. You withhold the truth. Why do you think that is? What are you resisting? What are you resisting? Is it a time you smell the truth? They can't beat the sword. What are you resisting? Is it a time you stop? Don't. Help me. You're not going to be there. Stop the whole fight. Something pays. I'll tell you one thing. A bunch of renegade scientists didn't build this alone. Getting in there, not with those turrets in place. What the? Bodies. Probably executed. What the hell are we walking into here? Come on, let's get inside that lab. Turrets are probably hooked up to generators. If we could find them, we could shut up that way. Generator here. Like that did the trick. Shit. We didn't get all. Gotta be another generator somewhere. some answers? More than ready.
one big difference between this place and New Hope. They weren't worried about getting found. No fake shipping depot up front. upset about a pinprick i have sensitive hands proper identification is required for entry your entry has been denied good day oh uh, what niles is that you proper identification is required for entry proper identification hey you can give it a shot but it's gonna hurt more than you think Spouting knobs more than this cryptic garbage can. Ah, I see you've met my vastly inferior construct at New Hope. This way, please. What the hell? It's freezing in here. Goodness, apparently some of our cryojets are malfunctioning. There must be a fault in our system. You don't say! Of course, we cannot proceed until those cryojets are disabled. Would you mind, terribly? Miserable little garbage can, mother- Cryojets are probably powered like the turrets. Let's find a generator. Get back to that garbage can. Well done. Yeah, Jack's good like that. I've been meaning to reset those cryojets for quite some time. under the bridge. Over here, if you would. Can't have you wandering about unsupervised.
Please, this way. So after the cog shut you down, why come all the way out here? Our family needed a place to continue our work in solitude. <laughs> no way your family built this alone. I am quite certain you lack the necessary clearances for that information. This next area is quite fascinating. What the hell? The path to every breakthrough is paved with failure. Here are some of our more unstable specimens. This breakthrough of yours, how did you manage it? One of the miners' children, as it happens. She was resistant to aging, disease. We raised her as our own. your genetic research. It's in here? Of course. Oh, shit. Hey, hey, Jack! Jack, come here! I need you to download everything off this terminal. Oh, man. I don't think I want to know what any of these file names mean. But when the extent of one very special child's genetic immunity to emotion became clear, our work began to soar. Please, go ahead. That, of course, is Mira, or as you know her, Queen Mira. You bred her with the sires? Nothing so monstrous. Her stem cells, however, were delightfully complementary to sire DNA. But we underestimated so much. Young Mary's strong maternal feelings, for instance. Let me guess. She led her children to slaughter you all. No, no, no. Well, yes. But I meant her more traditional maternal feelings. For her daughter. Little Raina. Your mother. You're lying. I am not. Your mother was born here, and taken from us by her spineless father, thus causing young Mira's unfortunate rebellion. Why are you telling me this? You have so many gifts, you do not yet understand. Hey, what's going on? He will kill you if he knows. They all will. What did you just say? Hey, hey. You come here with me. What did JD tell you? Kate, I am not gonna hurt you. No? Maybe you should. Maybe I should. Hey. That would indeed sever the link between you and the locust. Now shut up! I won't let them do to me what they did to my mother. Your mother? And what did they do to your mother? In the hive. They changed her. 
It killed her. I killed her. But that is the process that allows them to learn, to grow. Without a queen, they remain unguided. See? See? I'm a weapon. No. You're not. Back in the village, when I was inside that snatcher, I was controlling them. What? I think I killed Oscar. Wait a minute. It... You think? Or you did? I don't know. I don't know. I just... I want it out of my head. I want it to stop. And you're gonna stop it. And if I do not? Then we delete you and destroy every bit of your precious research. Then please, allow me to assist you. And we're supposed to just trust your good word here? You are free to trust or not trust whomever you like. But tell me something. Your mother and the Hive, did she resist? Of course she did. So I feared. Young Mira needed no such crude incorporation. Niles, tell me. My grandfather. Who was he? One of my best geneticists. He fled with little Reyna because he no longer believed in our work. Did Mira know where he took her? I told Mira Reyna had perished in the escape attempt. I assumed that would end the matter. I greatly miscalculated. this way. But it appears we have another malfunction. Perhaps you could address it? Right. How does it work? 
by mildly damaging your brain. What? By mildly damaging her brain? Her connection to the locust is based on a genetic algorithm inside her temporal lobe. Altering that requires anesthesia, you could say. It sounds like a lobotomy. A lobotomy is highly invasive. This is directed. While I work, the matriarch will guide your mind undetected to where it must go. Okay, all right. No, 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 no. You are not doing this. I do not trust this can. Then watch him. But I have to do this. I'm losing control. I won't hurt anyone else, understood? Understood. Surely you see 
I've done you a kindness. You are no longer vulnerable to the hive mind, and your mother has been awakened. Well, so to speak. Oh, I'm gonna fucking kill you! I don't think you can hear us. I don't give a shit! Cryogenic lockdown commencing. Shit! We gotta stop it! Look our way through! There's gotta be a way to lift this lockdown! Fire in the hole! 
You see, what you don't realize, what none of you realize, is that our children will never die. They have been designed to withstand generational conflict. They may withdraw, they may hibernate, but they will always return. We have seen to that. I am really looking forward to setting that garbage can up! There's gotta be a way to open it. Maybe there's something Jack can do. See where that leads. Okay, more locusts are coming. Then hold them off. Hey, Jack, don't take your time on this. Let's go. 
I got a glimpse inside his head. You don't want to know. So then let's 
Keep after Niles. Come on. Hey, Niles! We're still coming! I really don't think he can hear you. I really don't care! be undone. This planet is now theirs. I told you I'd get you.
She would, if she could. But she's not my mother anymore. Then who is she? Their queen. Come on, time to get out of here. their queen and Nas is right about what happens next we need a new plan no we need the old plan we need the hammer of dawn We came here to make things better, but I made them worse. And you're sure what you saw was real? It was real. Okay, then maybe she'll, I don't know, help us somehow. She would, if she could. But she's not my mother anymore. Then who is she? their queen and Nas is right about what happens next we need a new plan no we need the old plan we need the hammer of dawn Speaking of one of a kind, help me hook up this skip. You find what you're looking for? Yeah. And now we need to kill it. Is she, you know, all right? Not really. But let me ask you something. How long would it take to get the Hammer of Dawn up and running? Funny you should ask. The data drive you found months ago about the UIR. Yeah? Interesting stuff. Interesting how? You'll see. And lucky for us, I have an old UIR contact. Take us home, Sam. Got it, sweet cheeks.
Welcome to Vasgar, home to the Union of Independent Republic's secret space program. Never been in UIR territory before. You still have it. Vasgar was independent. The UIR had the pleasure of occupying... No, excuse me, liberating this glorious land. Okay, remember how I told you only pissed off nomads lived out here now? Meet Garen Paddock, the most pissed off and nomadic of them all. This is your old UIR contact? Two things I dislike, Baird. The cog and children. You've brought me both. Two things I dislike? Old men and deserts. And yet, here we are. Ha! <laughs> I like this one. Follow me. So, it turns out the UIR space program went way beyond what the COG publicly revealed. Somewhere in this Cosmodrome here, there's a rocket loaded with functional Hammer of Dawn satellites. I think we can get the entire system back online, and start hitting the swarm where they live. If the UIR has satellites during the Pendulum Wars, why didn't you use them? The politicians wanted their armistice. Launching those satellites would have guaranteed another century of war. But still, someone our military tried to launch. It kinda triggered a small civil war, actually. So we know this Cosmodrome's layout. Where are the satellites? Try the rocket hangar. Here. And the wind flares are too severe to fly over that desert. So that's where your skiff comes in. Question. How do we know these satellites are still functioning? Or if they're even compatible with ours? Answer. We don't. And that's where you come in. Unless you're too cowardly, or stupid, or weak. <laughs> Who is that? A friend, believe it or not. But for now, get to know the layout of that place. There's a good chance most of it's buried in sand. Oh, and uh, come and see me before you go.